Hello and welcome. This is Raheem Zulfikar Ali from Excel Basement Private Limited. In this video tutorial, we will learn that how to look up and return multiple values in one cell in Microsoft Excel. And we will not be using any VBA macro. Uh, we will be utilizing Excel Dynamic Array and a very easy formula to execute this issue. So I have two columns in my data. Uh, the card ID numbers and the cell phone numbers. So first I need to have a unique list for the card IDs and that will be the lookup value from which I will have the output from the second column which is the cell numbers. Right. So as a traditional Excel user might be because in this particular column of card ID there are duplicates. So might be you copy this list and paste here and you apply uh, remove duplicate option from the data tab, right? And then you will get the unique values. But we will not use this feature. We will utilize one dynamic array formula that is unique. And we will just select the range or, or array you can say from A3 to A20. So now you can see that this specific dynamic array formula returns the unique values from a list which is a card ID number column. Now we want the cell phone numbers for each of the card ID number in just one single cell, right? And for that, we, we are utilizing Excel dynamic array formula and if function as well. And I hope that you understand what is if. And most of the users has gone through with this function. So let's get start. E equals to text join delimiter because this is possible that there are there must be multiple values and we we need to have some spaces or comma between two values so we need to define a delimiter so i will put comma space within inverted commas for the de which is the delimiter and definitely i will use ignore empty cells so for that i need to write true here and from here i will be utilizing if function so if this card id which is in e3 is equals to a range of card ids column which is starting from a3 to a20 and i will make this range absolute then the value of true will be a returning output will be from the second column which is of cell numbers and we will also make this absolute by pressing f4 key if the value will not match and the output will not come. So in the value of false, we will add a blank, which is two inverted commas together, which means blank, nothing. And we will close the brackets. Now you can see that very easily without any macro or complex formula, uh, we are getting multiple return values in one single cell according against the each card ID number, right? Now what what happens next is, uh, for example, if there are duplicates in the cell numbers, for example, if I copy the first cell number and let me paste it here. Now there are two exactly same numbers for this first specific card ID and I don't want the duplicates in the returning values. So definitely you want the unique values, right? So there is one little addition of dynamic array formula would be so before the if we will be adding unique dynamic array formula and at the end we will just put one more round bracket and we will just copy and paste this formula downwards amazing now you can see that you are getting a lookup with a return multiple values without a duplication by adding three functions uh, if unique and text join so we're using the latest version of microsoft excel with a subscription you can have the dynamic array formulas in it and without uh, applying VLOOKUP or XLOOKUP or any other kind of macro, uh, dynamic array formulas are definitely reshaping the Excel in the practice we are using uh, writing the formulas. So I hope you like this video. 